I'm Michelle Phillips and I'm the Google for Education Certified Trainer. In this video, I'm going to talk about the Google Slides skills needed to do well on the Google Educator exams, both Level 1 and Level 2. For Level 1, we're going to look at creating a Google Slides presentation, inserting and arranging text, shapes, lines, and word art, as well as creating link text, embedding videos, and sharing slides presentations. To create a Google Slides presentation, go to New and then choose Google Slides. You can then choose a theme for your Google Slides. You can import a theme. You can change the layout and the background and add transitions. You can insert text boxes, images, charts, videos, word art, lines, shapes, tables, animations, slide numbers. To insert and arrange text, you just insert a text box and then you can move it where you want it to be. To insert a shape or a line, you choose what kind of shape you want to insert. Make it the size you want it to be, and then you can move it around. While it's selected, you can change the color of the shape. You can also change the line color or how thick the line is. you're going to insert lines, you can choose lines, arrows, different kinds of connectors or curves. You can change the thickness of those lines and the colors. You can also insert word art. You can then resize the word art. You can also change the font of the word art, and you can change what color it is. You can also, when you want to add more slides, you can just choose the plus sign or choose what kind of layout you want on your slide. You can also link text on one slide to another. So if I would select text, I can then send it to another slide or a website by inserting link I can then choose a slide in this presentation, or I can copy and paste a link from somewhere else. So if I'm in present mode, and I click there, it will take me to the next slide, or wherever I, I designate it to go. If you want to insert a video, go to insert, insert video. Then you have the option of searching YouTube, or inserting it by URL. So I'm going to insert a video by the URL. It shows you the preview. I'm going to click select and then it will embed it on the slide. I can resize it. I can move it where I want it to be. And then while I'm in present mode, I can play it simply by clicking on it and it will play it within the video slide. To share your document, you can go to the blue share button. You can then give specific people editing, commenting, or viewing access, or you can click advanced and choose whether it's on for anyone on the web with the link or just inside Prosper ISD with the link or by searching. You can also share by going to file and then clicking share and the same options will appear. For level one, I've shown you how to create a slides presentation, insert arrange text shapes and lines, insert word art, create linked text, embed a video, and how to share a Google Slides presentation. Now let's look at skills needed for level two. In level two, you will need to know all of the skills needed in level one, including inserting shapes, images, and other objects, and also how to hyperlink slides so when you click it will go to a specific slide. Another skill that you need for level two is know how to direct comments. So when the document is shared with someone else you can go to comments and then when you want to direct it to a specific person you will type the plus sign and start typing their name or email address. As their name appears, you click on it. You then have the option of typing a message behind it or an action or a direction. And then you can actually click to assign it to that person. When you're done, click comment. 
For the level 2 Google Educator exam, the skills needed for Google Slides includes those in level 1, such as inserting shapes and images, hyperlinking slides, and you also need to know how to direct your comments. For more resources, please go to my website, edtechinaction.com.